Hey, what is going on guys? It's your boy Rhodes. I'm back for another video. Today I'm going to be showing you an easy logo tutorial. This is how I used to make my logos when I was new to GFX. But today is going to be a tutorial on showing you how to make them. So let's get into this. So you just want to press file on new. Make this 800 pixels by 800 pixels. And resolution 72. Pixels, 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 inch. Then you just want to quickly change that to white. Now you should have a nice 800 by 800 background. So now you want to right click on the paint bucket tool here. Click on gradient. Go up here. Double click this and change it to black. Then you want to double click the other side. And also change that to black. So now it will give you a solid black background. Now you want to click on the text tool and make the text bigger, a lot bigger. Change this to white. And then you want to just put a letter. So I'm going to make mine, let's just do R for red. The font I'm using is Batman Forever Ultimate. Just look it up on Google and it will come up. But you can do this with any font. Let's make this bigger. Now you want to get a background that you really like. So let's go to my pictures folder. So you want to go file, place links. Uh, where is it? Wherever your picture is saved, you can either look one up on Google or you can just go, use one that you've already got, it, which is mine's here. Then you want to scroll down or look for the picture you want. So let's say I want I make a lot of logos for people. Um, let's just use this background because it looks nice. I don't think I can look normal. So it's like a desert island, I guess. So you just want to place it like that. Then with it highlighted, you want to press this and go darken. So then it will go inside the R or whatever your letter is. Then you can have your name down the bottom. Let's just shrink this a lot. Reds. I'm just going to shrink this down quite a bit. So it doesn't need to be big. Then you want to right click on your picture. You want to duplicate layer. Okay. Then you just want to move the duplicated layer down. And make sure it's on top of this. And there, it looks sick. I highly recommend if you're new to GFX, you practice this way. Just get this right. So if you're new to GFX, I think you should um, practice this way because it just makes logos look nice. And if you want more effects, I guess you can do this. So first thing you want to do is click on the like logo R for me. You want to right click and press rasterize type then we'll use the polygon lasso tool that one and just make a random shape out of it so let's just do this then you want to select the moving tool and you can move that to the side of it so then you can experiment with this and like you've got to be quite imaginative I guess to make this look good So, you just want to keep, like, make, just do, practice with this, I guess, and it should make it look a lot better. So, the, this is a really easy logo tutorial. I hope you enjoyed. Sub for more and peace out.